And during that meeting at the Blue House, Korea's education minister detailed the government's key initiatives related to innovation as a source of growth. And he unveiled how his ministry plans to put the president's words into action, namely by building a talented workforce. Kim Ji-an reports. The core factor of innovation-led growth is nurturing talented people, who the Ministry of Education explained are those with the spirit to take on challenges, those who are creative, knowledgeable and tech-savvy, and those who know how to work in a team. Korea's Education Minister Kim sang gun said the ministry will strengthen the country's education system so that schools can incorporate creativity into their curriculum through things like presentations and debates, which teach students how to articulate their thoughts. The minister said it will also strengthen software and IT-related subjects so that the leaders of tomorrow can be trained to navigate the era of the Internet of Things and big data. Ten universities will be designated next year as pioneering education in tune with the so-called fourth industrial revolution. And the ministry will raise funds of nearly 18 and a half million U.S. dollars to encourage college students to pursue their own startup businesses. For newly emerging occupations in the tech world, the ministry plans to set up a platform dedicated to providing various job opportunities and training content. And it says it'll work on improving job security by, for example, raising wages and expanding infrastructure so that anyone willing to learn can access related tech and information, particularly women and youth. Kim Jian, Arirang News.